Made for advertising has certainly caused a lot of confusion in our industry as of late. The way DV defines made for advertising is those av uh, websites that sole purpose is for advertisement and whose monetization techniques uh, generates a, a significant amount of advertisements on the site. Also you can see a um, we, DV notices a spectrum of signals that come from the um, monetization and traffic driving techniques. Um, as of today, DV clients can protect themselves from made for advertising websites uh, through um, their um, brand safety and uh, or, or currently utilizing their current brand safety and fraud protections. Uh, DV services um, can offer protections via um, both uh, the monitoring and blocking of their campaigns and also through pre-bid avoidance in major DSPs. Connected TV has certainly uh, risen dramatically in popularity which has made it a, um, a prime target for uh, CTV fraud, or fraud, fraudsters in the CTV space. Um, we have actually seen that CTV has become the prime target for ad fraudsters. Um, this has been supported by uh, uh, data points in DV's most recent Global Insights report, uh, 20, uh, 2023 edition, which highlighted that uh, CTV fraud screams tripled in number from 2020 to 2023. And we've also seen uh, CTV bot fraud rise 69% um, uh, uh, from 2021 to 2022. As of today, um, CTV's sophisticated combination of um, AI and uh, fraud specialists, um, the Sidenar uh, CTV or Sidenar fraud team, utilize techniques to um, isolate and eradicate uh, much of uh, CTV ad fraud as they possibly can. Um, and this can be done through our both, again, protections in um, and, and blocking in CTV and uh, um, available both on the uh, post-bid measurement and pre-bid blocking. The competition for attention is large and attention is somewhat fragmented with a you know, significant number of ads available or out there in the ecosystem to date. And those clients focusing on attention optimization or at least attention measurement um, put themselves in a, a strong position to really um, cut through the noise if you're focusing on those kind of key attention measurements. Um, what we've found with uh, DV's Authentic Attention is uh, clients utilizing it today um, are able to deploy it across a wide range of campaign goals. For example, uh, DV, if a client's optimizing towards um, uh, an exposure or exposure um, indexes, um, we found that they have a, um, a positive impact on a brand lift or favorability goals. And if a client is focusing on attention measurement um, indices around exposure, it has a positive impact on direct response. Um, so it's down to the key elements of uh, measuring that and then optimizing towards that, those sort of goals. With regards to the optimization approach, clients have the ability to uh, today to uh, not only measure attention, but optimize um, towards attention measurement in a variety of ways. Clients can activate Double Verify's standard or dynamic um, attention segments um, in a pre-bid environment. Um, which uh, will drive a positive impact on attention or those who are looking for a more sophisticated approach will be able to utilize their attention measurement in their um, uh, current campaign and optimize towards uh, positive uh, data points uh, through custom algorithms um, utilizing companies such as Cybids which DV recently acquired.